I don't like hot tamales. They make your breath stink. They smell like cinnamon. But I feel like a hot tamale, though. <laughs> My husband might like me because he love that candy. <laughs> my channel it's your girl carrie if you're new here make sure you hit that red subscribe button turn on post notifications so you don't miss anything when i upload if you ain't new welcome back boo let's go ahead and get it popping so first of all it's another episode of flawless fall features which means i'm gonna be featuring another wig bay on my channel okay so every week for the whole entire month of november i will be featuring three beautiful ladies and we're all gonna be reviewing a wig unit that we're inspired to review or wear for the month of fall whether it's color, texture, whatever. Everybody got their own style, okay? So today is going to be Deanna Monet TV. Now, Deanna is my girl, okay? She was the first person that I ever did a wig collaboration with, and that was January of this year. That's crazy because I just started reviewing wigs this year. So when we collabed, I was like, oh, I felt kind of grateful. You know what I'm saying? So thank you, girl. And thank you for being a part of this collaboration here again, girl. You know you my boo. And she also has her own business, which is um, Monet Dior Couture. And she has a lot of like jewelry and accessories and it's bomb. I've showed some of some of my videos. So if you didn't see it, you need to check it out. I'll, I'll you know, throw some clips and some links and stuff around but that's my boo so when you're finished watching this review make sure you check out hers to see which wig she's slaying because i know it's gonna be something cute she look cute and everything okay she gonna kill it y'all if you came through from her channel hey what's up how you doing make sure you hit that button okay it's free do it hook a sister up <laughs> but let's go ahead and get started with the review all right, so the wig that we're gonna be reviewing today is from Outre, and it's the Melted Hairline Collection. I did review one unit before, I think it was Catalina this year. May I may have done some more too, but I know for a fact I did Catalina. But I'll pop it in the description box up here and at the end of the video, just in case you didn't see it and you wanna check it out. And it's supposed to basically kind of give you like a frontal look. It's supposed to be a nice melted pre-plucked hairline kind of feel, but it's really not because you just get a part and then it, they're supposed to be plucking and squeezing like the hairline and stuff. So that's what this is supposed to be. Now, um, you do get a little bit of baby hairs. It always says no plucking required, pre-attached wide elastic band, and it is heat safe up to 400 degrees. Now I have Martina in the color DRFF red velvet which is basically like this hot red burgundy mix and it's absolutely gorgeous i must say as far as the construction of this unit is a basic construction you got two combs in the front one in the back some elastic straps but like i said you do have that elastic headband and i will say that the lace is just kind of brown you know it's a little brown it's a little light for me so i'm gonna have to fix that up that's nothing they did give us a lot of lace to work with a lot of lace to work with so i'm super happy about that as far as the texture of jump i already see it's a light yakky texture it does have a little bit of silk to it but not too much so it's more on the light yakky side i can get with it the hair texture is really really soft to the touch and i'm like okay now straight on the head i already could see that this unit is going to fit you it's definitely a big hair friendly unit they give you a whole bunch of lace to work with from ear to ear that you're gonna have to end up cutting off i didn't cut it all off i just kind of tucked it under or whatever and you also kind of get like um just a lot of space in this unit. So if you have a large head, you'll be able to fit it. I am a 22 and a half, which is like stepping out of mediums, getting into the large size. So you don't have to worry about it not fitting you. This unit will fit you, okay? So they did a really good job with the space and like just giving you that room on the forehead area. Like it's getting air to air and you're getting up in the forehead. You get to cover your whole hairline with this unit. I'm here for it. I think that the style of this unit is really, really pretty. Um, It's just like straight to the point. You don't have to do anything to it. It's ready to go as far as the style goes now as far as laying her down you could go ahead and glue her down if you want to i'm gonna tell you she's gonna flap on the sides especially if you don't cut off the extra lace on the sides so if you want 
to kind of melt her down or something like that you can it is a you know the melted hairline collection so it's meant to be melted i only kind of did like just the middle section to kind of get a feel of what it would look like if i did melt it and i would say i am really impressed the lace does look really good up against my skin of course i did tint it with the even tint spray so it kind of gave me a little bit of color to the point where i almost forgot to add powder like i almost didn't need the powder but the powder did give it that extra natural look to it so they did really good with the naturalness of the lace however the hairline although it is pre-plucked i do feel like it could have been plucked a little bit more it doesn't give me like a super super pre-plucked look it said no plucking required but this is a unit that you can wear like this but if you want that ultra slayage you would probably want to go in and pluck it a little bit more this red velvet color absolutely beautiful definitely bold it's a fiery color um i thought it was going to be a little bit more on the burgundy side so it's a little bold i don't care though i'm not scared of bold i'm just telling you what i thought it was gonna be so bold it is okay i like bold too hey let's get the color popping the style of this unit kind of reminds me of the tiana wig from janet collection and it also reminds me of um ayana like the style is really really similar but i feel like this is just a little bit longer if you didn't see my reviews on those i'll definitely link it they look very similar and you know different textures different feels different colors but they look really much alike i'm telling you as far as the density goes i feel like it's um it's a little bit past natural density but a little under being super super full it's like perfect it's like right in between so if you like full here you may like it if you like natural density you may like it it's not too much to deal with but it's not too little as far as snags go i did hit a couple little cracks and pops i did like you know like when you feel your finger like crack it through the hair so it does have a little bit of tangling just a little bit not something that you need to be going crazy about i'm not getting any shedding with the unit one thing that i did notice that i'm not a fan of is it does feel a little bit thin up here like you could feel the tracks you probably can't see it we're gonna learn together when we watch this video but i i just don't like feeling it because i feel like i'm exposed if you don't see it then it's all good my only issue that i'm having with this particular unit is this right here like you see how like the style is supposed to be flipped once it start not acting right i'd be so mad because this side is not flipping right you know it's supposed to be flipped like this side i'm having a problem with that i'm having a problem with it but that's just my unit doesn't mean everybody's unit is going to be like it overall i think it's a very pretty unit i think it's soft to the touch it's pretty you get the yakky feeling and give you a little natural like i got a silk press or something like that so i'm i'm here for it i think they did an amazing job on the lace the style the color hairline could have been a little bit better like i said it could have been a little bit more pre-plucked but it does look pre-plucked so i can't be mad at it all the way i do love that they did give you all this lace to work with from ear to ear and from front to back and is actually spacious enough to fit it so a1 for that okay so on average it's running between 35 and 38 dollars it's okay for that price. I'm going to say it's okay for that price. But everything else that you would want out of a wig, especially if you're spending that kind of money, especially for, you know, the hairline, the illusion and all of that stuff, is good, sis. That melt looks amazing, okay? That melt looks so good. I didn't even have to pull out the baby hairs to kind of make it look natural. It looks so good. So they did amazing with that lace. What? What? Listen who mad i ain't mad and i'm fiery i got the color and stuff oh baby i'm hot in this thing i like this unit they did they thing with this one they did they thing with this one right here but that is it y'all i think i done hit everything on this unit i can't think of anything else to say let me know what you think about this unit right here because i'm feeling like a hot tamale Ooh, i don't like hot tamales they make your breath stink they smell like cinnamon but i feel like a hot tamale though <laughs> my husband might like me because he love that candy <laughs> Now, let me stop, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and go, though. Make sure y'all hit up Deanna Monet TV. See which wig she is slaying. And again, thank you, girl, for being part of my collab and my little series I got going on here. You know I love you, girl. I'm going to put her link in the description box below. And if you came through from her channel, like I said at the beginning, what's up? Welcome. And hit that button for you, girl. Go ahead. It don't cost nothing. I ain't going to bite you. I ain't going to... I ain't gonna do that. <laughs> but I'm gonna let y'all go. I'll see y'all in my next video. I'll holla.